What's up guys, nice to see you on my channel, hope you're all doing great and today I want to show you how I'm doing product photography with the real client. So, let's go! And as a product today we will be using this watch from our today's sponsor Filippo Loretti. They are producing high quality watches already for a long time. And they have provided for me opportunity to select one of them for myself. And I have decided to go with this model, which is actually have stainless steel body, sapphire glass and a moon face, which is actually a really rare feature for a lot of watches. So, if you will be interested in this specific model of the watch or any other from their website, I will put link in the description box together with my promo code, which will give you 50% of the discount. So, let's go with the details of the photo shoot. For this photo shoot, we will be using Sony 135mm f1.8 G Master lens with a fantastic quality. Unfortunately, this lens don't have a macro feature, but but it still not will stop us from getting really nice product photos. We'll be using this lens together with my camera B, Sony A7C, because unfortunately my camera A is not working, Sony A7S3 is broken, flip out screen not showing anything. But that is a story for another video. So that is our setup, Sony A7C together with 135mm f1.8. Additional to that we'll be using this light as our main light to highlight our object and as a second light we'll be using this window which will help you to add let's say a little bit of shadows to your object and right now let me explain you what i will be doing because we have a watch and that is actually luxury product i want to make sure that this luxury product will be popping up from something which is looking actually also luxury so we need a couple more items for this shot item number one that will be this laser bag let's say i don't know actually which brand it is but that is actually nice looking bag and we will be using this bag as additional background for our watch so yeah that is item number one and item number two that is cologne that is all what i have in my head so back, cologne and watch. I will try to prepare the shot and we will start shooting. And after that, of course, we'll edit those photos together. So stay with me. And by the way, for the time lapse of the photo shoot, I will be using iPhone 12 Pro Max because unfortunately I don't have camera A right now. So iPhone 12 Pro Max becoming my camera B and Sony A7C becoming my camera A. Right now let's set up the shot and after that we'll start work. Small tip when you are working with a product make sure that no any other products presented in a shot. That means I'm talking about labels. Like example it still can be bad but there no should be visible branded content of other companies but right now we finally have set up everything we have a bag we have a watch we have a cologne there it looks really good right now on my opinion and we can take couple shots and see if it's working for us or not and after that of course we'll edit them that is initial setup like you see here everything is pretty simple i use these handles to like put my object in the center to make sure that I create in some frame for the object and people really will be focused on this object when they will be watching all my photos. So that is highly important. And during the photo shoot, it's also important that you will show all details of your product. Again, that is not macro lens, but we still can trick, let's say, it, our camera, if I can say so. Now I will remove Sony A7C from this tripod and put instead iPhone 12 Pro Max. So whole shoot will be recorded, time lapse will be recorded on iPhone 12 Pro Max. Just keep it in mind. So let's go with the photo shoot.
right now when all shots are completed it's time to edit let's go What do you think about end result? I think those shots are fantastic. But let me know in the comments what is your opinion on that one. I just interested to hear additional critic from your side. But yeah, that's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Again, shout out to our sponsor Filippo Loretti for providing me this model of the watch on the review. Really appreciate it, you guys. And of course, yeah, subscribe on my channel if you still not subscribe. Give this video a big thumbs up if you like what I'm doing. Of course, subscribe on my Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, whatever you find in the description box. And see you in the next one. Already pretty soon. Take care. Bye.